Hello fellow campers, welcome to Sweden in the camp Mjoknaben. Jesus, if you know Swedish, please read the title, it will tell you everything. Um, this We are in the Ansen uh, National Park in Skane State, south of Sweden. And uh, this campsite is pretty nice and it's 25 euro per night, which is very cheap, included electricity, which is perfect, just no Wi-Fi. The bathrooms and toilets are basic, but that we're gonna see a little bit later. Let's start. This is the main highway, if you can say that it's a highway. You enter from here, whoop, and instantly this is the reception. Here you can park your vehicle or caravan, leave some space for the other ones. Over there, from behind, there is the garbage container. They don't have anything for recycle, so everything goes in the same bin. Let's start the walk. This is the main parking, here is the cafe and the reception. The reception is automatic, so I don't know if you've seen this before, it was my first time. So you can select your language, Swedish, English or German, pay by card. Here you type your uh, how many days you want to stay, your license plate, etc. It's really easy. The cafe offers coffee, salads and some uh, snacks. The balcony is pretty nice, continues further there. Here you have the cabins that you can rent and straightforward is the toilets washing wash and washers and showers. This is where you enter. Uh, what I don't like is that the um, gate pin is from this side so when you're driving you need to go out if you're alone press the uh, pin code and then the gate will open you enter the car and then you can drive but that's a bummer so all the time edit is going my wife is going to do that while I drive so the gate lifts up on the way back you don't need to do anything just come till here and the gate opens automatically this is the place where you where camper vans and, ca and uh, uh, motorhomes can empty their uh, chemical toilets This is the drive for the first section of the camp, that's us, but that will show you later when I make a big circle. Let me show you the toilet facilities and showers. This is where you can wash your face, and these are the toilets. As I said, but clean so my problem is that they are not very spacious so I think that this is this space is suitable for two toilets but for three it's very narrow and uh, kind of if there are three people sitting next to each other it feels kind of kind of awkward so yeah let me continue and show you the rest of the camp showers clean hot water is here you have space to put your clothes hang them if you want yep this is the chemical toilet disposal yep Not pretty basic but that, that's what you need this is the first section of the camp I think this is uh, these are permanent Ma many of them are permanent but I'm not sure I want to say I will not make a circle from there because there are people and I don't want to intrude their privacy here you can fill up your water just across the toilets so let's make a circle from here every spot is marked with signs and uh, on every third pitch there is the electrical box which uses the three big plugs so yeah this continues further like that i will cut it from here because there is a new camper i don't want to intrude their privacy 
this is another section and that section here is the one for tents over here there is a picnic area where you can have lunch they are a camp that rents canoes and motorboats because this is very popular fishing area and area with um, islands basically an inland archipelago see these are the canoes and here we go see these are the motorhomes the motor uh, the motorboats as we are on the lake you have many of these pits that you can use to make grill when the weather is nice not now and then here is the table when you come back from fishing here you can clean up your fish uh, it even smells on fish okay that's it let me wrap it up towards our campsite our camp yep, this is our spot guys thank you for watching this is the first campsite in Sweden and tomorrow we are going up north to Tibena National Park from where I'm gonna come back to you with a new campsite. See you then, bye bye!